Right, here we go. What I believe to be a Williamson amplifier. KT66 Osram output tubes. 6B5s. The rectifier's been changed for a solid state circuit. Massive transformers as you can see. Two chokes are in there. Uh, 20 Henry's at 40 mil. A, a 20, sorry, a 10 Henry's at 200 mil. And uh, lots of options on the output transformer and uh, primary and secondary options. Ah, oh, absolutely beautiful. I think anywhere from 3 ohms to about 15 ohms for the speaker, but many options in between, and um, might be more than that as I remember. I'm not going to turn it over now because I'm one handed and uh, it's too much of a risk. It weighs over 20 kilograms, and what a beast! I think it's a Williamson. I was in there yesterday, we had a quick look. Uh, it's not ultra linear. The center tap is not used. Someone's been in there and disconnected it and done a few things. They've changed the mains cable at some point. This is a very recent find. I've just got this for 40 pound, can you believe? With the valves, um, crazy. I found a box of valves as well that went um, as a separate cell for six pound. And we've got shitloads of KT61, uh, sorry, 66s in there. We even got KT88s, brand new, old stock. Six of them are in there. I can't believe what I found. But um, this one is actually a beast. I'm going to put it back to Williamson, I think, and uh, go with it from there. Maybe upgrade it afterwards. But that's probably my Williamson amplifier that I've been looking for for a long, long while. And I've just found it for 40 quid. What a find. What a find. Someone's done away with the rectifier. In fact, I'm going to go one handed. It's got. It's just had a clean up on the outside, anyway. Look at those beasts, man. Four microfads. Got four of them in there. Oh, what a beast. Here we go. The other choke is in between there, that's the 10 Henry. Solid state rectifier. My neighbours today are so noisy, so I've been trying to do this a few times. But check that out, ain't that a beauty? Wow. 45 quid, I fucking can't wait to hear this. <laughs> it's gonna be a beast. You see the silicon diodes up there? Someone's used a valve socket for it and uh, kept that in place. I think I'll put it back to rectify a valve and um, I prefer them normally. I think it does affect the sound. People say it doesn't but I think it does quite often. Or well, we can at least experiment with this one and find out for ourselves. We don't think it's homemade because the metal work is just too good. So who it is, what it is, we don't know. I'm hoping it's partridge on the transformers and the, and the uh, coils. I'm really hoping it's partridge or gardeners. We're going to take it apart and have a look at one's point. But right now it's going in storage or it's going over to the service technician probably in a few weeks from now. Probably within two weeks from now actually because I've got to get things done quickly. Anyway, what a beauty.